Hey, what's up my people? How you doing? My name is Dalton. This is my YouTube channel, Dalton My World. And this is going to be the EBT updates for January 2021, part one. All right. And also it's going to be the P EBT updates. Got some exciting news and I'll share it with you. Okay. So let's do this i've got my notes on my clipboard and i got my water all right so you get your coffee get your snacks and let's get ready to rock and roll now before i even start let me explain this little weird thing on my shelf on my collar right here yes it's a microphone okay now and I did an unboxing for it, so I'll upload that later on in a month for you, so you can check it out. Now, the first thing I wanted, I forgot to tell you, the first thing I want to tell you about this uh, EBT right now, with this from the new stimulus package, uh, the second stimulus package, the one that we're getting the uh, $600 uh, stimulus from, okay? I forgot to tell you this, this is super important. If you're a college student, or if you know some college students, please give them this information. With this new stimulus package that, we, that was turned into law, the EBT allows college students to get SNAP, okay? Even if you're at home, you're from home, you, you know, you're going to college from home because of the coronavirus, EBT allows college students to get SNAP now. So you can go and apply for SNAP, go and apply for EBT, food stamps, whatever you want to call it. All right. That is awesome. I meant to tell you all that. Now, there looks like they're going to be rolling out this 15% in uh, waves. Okay. Because I've been told some people have gotten it and some people have. And if you haven't, uh, you want to call 211 or call your casework and find out what's going on. But they actually listed some states that are supposed to have it. Okay. Now, just because I don't, just like with the uh, maximum EBT I did in the past, just because I do not name your state does not mean that you're not getting that 15%. All states supposed to be getting the 15%, okay? Now, let's do this. The states that are listed, Arizona, California, Georgia. Georgia deserves it. They've been doing a lot, <laughs> especially with those elections, y'all. I'm glad it's over. Y'all don't have to watch them ads anymore. Hawaii. Iowa, Kentucky, Louisiana, Maryland, Mississippi, Missouri, Montana, New Jersey, North Carolina, Oregon, Lord knows Oregon needs it, Oklahoma, Texas, finally Texas, Utah, Virginia, Washington, West Virginia, and Wyoming. And I know uh, us here in uh, Pennsylvania, uh, Pittsburgh is getting it, okay, Pennsylvania. We definitely are getting it, okay. Uh, I got it. All right, now that is the EBT update, all right. Now... A lot of people will complain, well, I'm only giving 50%. If you already only got a small amount and you're only giving extra 15%, that 15% is good for six months. Okay, so it's going to be going out for six months. But there's going to be, it may be a major change coming after January 20th when our president elect Biden is sworn in. Okay, he may do something such as make sure that everyone, I know he's going to do it in his 
stimulus pack, the third stimulus package. But he may end up to saying, okay, I want everyone to get the maximum amount. So by the end of January, you might end up getting the maximum amount. See, things are changing day by day, okay? And as soon as he gets in, he's already going to be throwing out a bunch of executive orders to help us, American people. So stay tuned on that, all right? Now, he's already said that he's planning on doing an executive order to knock out $10,000 worth of student loans. That's right. So that's already going to help you. Now, here's the cool part. This is the PEBT update. Okay. Now, this blew my mind. I was looking through it. People, I can tell you, I've, I've looked through that thing many, many times and never seen anything about PEBT, you know, uh, uh, recently. Okay. And this is great news. Massachusetts, uh, you've been approved for the year 20 to 21. Okay. Yes. And it started on 12, 15, 2020. Why is this good news? Because they've finally given us the information, which means they're finally straightening things out where the information is going to be available to you and to me like the EBTs are is okay now just because you didn't hear your state don't mean you're not getting some 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 states probably already getting some EB some PEBTs but what I'm saying is that because it's dropping down to the database okay they're finally getting on board clearing out the cobwebs and doing what needs to be done now when biden gets in the office on the 20th he's going to straighten a lot of stuff out to make sure that you'll be able to get that information why because biden has been in uh in the government over 30 years okay he's been working at, he he understands how this works he understands what clogs the information up and how to get rid of that clog so everything's flowing smoothly and when he delivers his third stimulus package, he don't want any hiccups. He wants it going smoothly, going to the people. So, you know, his reputation is, built, is, is uh, depending on it. Okay. So he don't want no hiccups. So he's going to take, take care of any hiccups there are now. And he knows how because he has the experience. He's been through this several times before. Okay. So not a pandemic, but situations where you have to help people, you know, you create permanent or temporary task force and uh, uh, programs. Okay, he's been through this. So you, he'll know how to straighten this out. Now, this is a quick recap on that PEBT. If you have a child six years or younger, they now be able to get uh, PEBT for that child. Okay, and uh, so therefore, especially if the child is going to like daycare, okay, which is in a stimulus package, pay for that. They haven't been, they're still working out the details and they're going to flush it, you know, push it to you. Okay, but it has been approved. It is law. It's going to happen. So that's also good. So, you know, your child's going to get fed at home and at daycare. So that's, that's awesome. All right. So that's about it for my update. So my PEBT. All right. I hope this helped you. I have been reading your comments and I thank you for all my new subscribers, my existing subscribers and all your comments. And I have been reading them and what, what I have experience on, I do try to help you with. Okay. Now, as I already told you in the past, this is, this is a hobby. This is not my job, but I do try to help you. Okay, so I can't always get to you immediately. All right, so I hope you all have a great January. And if I get some updates and God, God's willing, I will do my best to get it out to you. Okay, and I ask you to share this. Give this video a thumbs up. All right, and... 
I love your comments. Just keep them respectful. Right. And subscribe if you like. And I'll wrap to y'all later. Peace out. Stay calm out there. I know it's a lot of chaos. But let's stay calm. Cool. Collective. We'll get through this together. And we're going to be in, enjoying some good food coming. I, I almost can guarantee you. We're about to enjoy some good eating. Okay. <laughs> All right. Peace out.